The principle of phase contrast microscopy. Simply explained. Do you often use phase contrast microscopy to check your cells? This video will give you a simple explanation of how it works. Phase contrast is by far the most frequently used technique in biological light microscopy. Living cells can be observed in their natural state when using this cheap and simple method. Fixation and labeling are not necessary. But what makes phase contrast microscopy so special? Unstained living cells absorb practically no light, which makes the cells barely visible under a bright field microscope. Using phase contrast, structures that are almost invisible with a bright field microscope are revealed. And this is how it works. When light passes through pigmented cells, like erythrocytes, it is absorbed, reducing the intensity. So pigmented cells are visible under the microscope with good contrast. However, non-pigmented cells absorb almost no light. As a result, those cells have poor contrast under the microscope. When light passes through these cells, there is only a slight phase shift that is almost invisible. In phase contrast microscopy, this slight phase shift is used to increase contrast by passing the non-diffracted light through the phase plate. The phase of the non-diffracted light is shifted so that an interference pattern is clearly visible. The non-pigmented cells are now visible with good contrast. Enough of theory. Enjoy your next microscopy session. If you found this video helpful, please give us a like and subscribe to the Ibidi channel.